If you want to learn to make this cup, stay tuned and keep watching. Okay, so I've mixed my epoxy and I mixed equal parts of my epoxy. So now I'm going to turn my machine on. It's a little loud, so I apologize. But I mixed 30 milliliters of epoxy because you want the epoxy to be a little bit thick so your alcohol ink runs. So I'm just going to put it on my cup. Make sure you're covering the entire surface of the cup. Now sometimes I won't use the entire uh, medicine cup of epoxy depending on the size of the cup, but I always mix 30 milliliters of epoxy. Okay, and then I am going to um, do my heat gun off camera to get all the bubbles out, and then I am going to show you guys the colors I am going to be using. Okay, so now that I got rid of the bubbles, I'm going to be using two alcohol ink colors. So the first one is going to be Mermaid, and then the second one is going to be Enchanted. And it's a pearl color okay so I don't really know exactly how I want to go about doing this one um, thinking of possibly a marble color or maybe just the swirls so I just kind of just let it run and then make sure you get in the bottom And then we're going to go in with Mermaid, if I can get it open. We're going to go in with Mermaid. Now I love the colors that she chose for this cup. Bottom. And then basically I just want to cover every surface of it. So now I'm going to go back in with the pink and you just kind of alternate. So I will show you guys before I do my heat gun on it. Okay, so I have all of it covered. So it's going to get a little loud because I am going to do my heat gun. But I'm going to show you guys how I maneuver my alcohol ink.
make sure you get the bottom. So that's basically how the cup is looking. I'll bring it closer in just a second. So this is how the cup is looking. Um, I kind of like it. So we're going to let this dry and then I'm going to come back and put the Louis Vuitton stickers on it. Okay, I've already put some of the decals on. But I'm just going to show you all how I did it real quick so I put my transfer tape on my vinyl sheet and you take a scraper just do this make sure you get all the bubbles on the uh, vinyl itself So I finished putting all the decals on the cup. Some of them did overlap a little bit, but that's okay. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and mix my equal parts of epoxy, and I will be right back to apply it. Alright, we are ready for epoxy. I mixed 30 milliliters of epoxy equal parts. Now even though I didn't put decals on the bottom, I still want to apply epoxy to it. We're going to take our heat gun and blow the bubbles. 